uh, if my girlfriend had to work had so hard, not, had, had not, not, if my girlfriend had not, uh, but then worked so hard, it would not make sense, right? If my girlfriend had not worked so hard, that would that would not be the proper grammar, right? Because we cannot say if my girlfriend. So if my girlfriend, if my girlfriend. Now, what do you think it is? Had, hadn't to. Oh, okay. Hadn't to. Work. Okay. Work so hard. So if my girlfriend hadn't to work so hard. Because when we start adding the hadn't, had, been able to, we are getting into perfect tenses. Also, this is simple past, so didn't. So my, if my girlfriend didn't, and we don't, we don't need this, just if my girlfriend didn't work so hard, did not, right? If my girlfriend didn't, right? So we keep it the simple, and then we say, we say the negative form, <coughs> did not, right? So didn't work so hard, then... That is the negative is why they cannot see each other. She is working so too hard to see each other, right? Thank you. Yeah, no problem. And then what about the last one there, uh, Abdul? If I, want, uh, if I went to a big area, I wouldn't be so tired all the time. Right. So if I went to bed earlier, that is the hypothetical imaginary situation. I wouldn't be so tired all the time. That is the result, right? Very good. Right, right. It is, it, it's very similar, but here with the second conditional, we're using the, on this exercise for the second conditional, we are using the if and the simple past. So simple past, we would keep it uh, go and went, right? But they mean the same thing. They mean the same thing. Because you are, so if you were to use the, the past perfect, if I had, uh, then you would be... Right, but then, but then you, but then you are talking about an action. You are talking about. You are not talking about a past action, right? So uh, I would not be so tired all the time. So the second clause is not referring to. It is referring to uh, an imaginary hypothetical situation, and not like past perfect, where you are talking about the past and then an action that happened in the past. So that that is the difference, right? Yeah, thank you.